Hey guys, and welcome back to Rames Games for more RimWorld. It's three in the. Sorry, it's three? Wow. Well, it's like 5 30 in the afternoon. And I want to make more of this game before I lose all motivation. How much metal do we have right now? <laughs> Shod. This is very shod. We have not much. In fact, we're spending our last 100 on that right there. I'm gonna have them mine. I wasn't gonna mine all that, but I'm going to do it now. I really need to... I wish when you... That was weird. I didn't bring up their actual person menus. Right, Psychic Drone. We need to keep an eye on... Satan here. What I'm gonna do is take Satan off of... any mining. Put you strictly on research, and now we're just gonna like. That way, only Satan will research and craft and all that stuff. Feeling bad, shared bedroom. Where? Right, because you slept in the cold. But that doesn't make any sense. It's not a shared bedroom. Do you have any wood or anything? I got an idea. I'm going to... How many blocks we got? What do we have more of limestone? Let's make a limestone wall. Right there. And then let's deconstruct that. That way Satan has their own room make Satan happy and all that. Made a thing. And from here we're going to grow cotton. I don't know what the bad thing that happens is when you do too much mining or whatever it is. The combat you only doing inside like, mines and stuff. Let's hope I don't have to find out. I'd prefer not to, in all honesty. It's gonna mine out here. They're gonna plan, like, a hallway or something. I'm gonna put all my storage right here. At least for the dumping and the blocks and the stuff like that. The visitors are leaving. You're right here. It's like... If you have this open, it doesn't do the character thing, I guess. Slept in the cold sucks for you. It's like drone medium. I need to make something for joy. Somebody make that. And then we're going to tell Satan when he wakes up. You know what? Satan, I'm gonna force you to like never mind, just have fun when you feel like it, I guess. I'd really like this uh psychic drone and the toxic fallout to end. Mainly the toxic fallout. Especially the toxic fallout. Psychic drone is ending. Good. So they're hungry, their mood is going quite down. It's their fault for being asleep. 
Just gotta keep, uh, say boot above 20. If it goes below 5, then it automatically breaks. And I think that's what those marks are. Satan's having fun now. Great. Mood's are getting up there again. Make sure that we don't have... What is your problem? Are you kidding me? 41% already. God, you're just freaking happy, window water. Got some loving. There's nothing like a tumble between the sheets to lift the mood. Oh my god, 32. And a little pain and worn out apparel, but I mean, you got that freaking loving, man. Why are you so much better with that than... Whatever. That's funny. I didn't know that was a thing. I don't know what we're researching, colored lights or something, yeah. Toxic fallout thing is not cool. Like, I know we can go outside. But I mean, we can't mine right now. Like, we can't physically go out and mine right now. Let's go ahead and do machining. Get that research going. Research of 15. It's probably going down, though. Toxic fallout has settled. Everything's dead. Wow. Glad we weren't out there, am I right? So let's go ahead and cancel that. Let's order that to be hauled. Let's lift all the things on the doors. Let's get all the woods being chopped. And let's get the restrictions back to unrestricted. And right now we'll just have them do anything whenever they feel like it. If it starts becoming a problem again, then we'll force them to have set times. But we need to get out here and find some resources now. Compact a machinery, that's not too bad. What is right here? I need to know. There's like a break in the wall. Yeah, that's why. I didn't know if it was that simple. So we need metal, we need to get that high tech research bench. That is something we need right now. Time to get it from here. Kind of far away, but I don't really have too many choices. Compact a plus steel. That's nice. And then animals can go back to just the home zone. I don't want them going too far. I'm glad I quickly figured out the whole home zone, restriction, all that stuff. Otherwise the toxic fallout could have very well killed everyone. I'm gonna switch all these storages back to low, I want to move everything. Trade beacon, you wanna tell me your range right now? Wish I could just move it. That'd be nice. How much does it cost? It's 50. I just need to make this area a little bit bigger, I guess. How 
Okay, so that's the area it actually covers. I'm just going to do another stockpile, like, zone out here. Let's do that here, and it's right below the dandelions. Uh, let's queue up a structure. We can do wood. Miscellaneous. How far is that again? It is right below the door. Uh, structure. Then we can put in a wood. No, don't accidentally do that. Jesus Christ. That would be really bad. We can move our main stockpile in here. Something. That way all they have to do is carry it in around the corner and drop it. Also, how large is this area? 7x15, the largest you can have is a 9x9. Nine nine without it caving in. So, just in case, let me that I guess. Storage. Can I like copy settings? Yeah. Then do a zone area. Deconstruct. Deconstruct. Delete. Stockpile zone. Paste settings. Since we have that low priority, and then we'll set this to uh, preferred. This will be critical, because it's like food and crap. There was a tree inside of our base the whole time. Oh, would you look at that? What is going on here? Oh, it's sandstone and this is wooden wall. Got a bunch of crap just lying around. Hopefully they can get all that good. Let's do like limestone floors. 412, that's fine. <laughs> Acts like I care for a second. Then that will sort that out. Then we can go back to wood floors for that. I want to get the metal, I don't want to get heaters, and I want to get all that stuff again. I didn't want to, but I'm going to play at three times speed. I don't know how much wood we have. No, I don't want to... Trying to click on all the things that I ordered to be cut, but I don't want to cut those, I just want to chop them. Okay, I don't want to chop all these. That's as far as I'm willing to go right here. How. Stop pausing at me. How big is this? 12 by 5, we should be able just to get rid of these without it caving in. Here's hoping. Let's delete that. It's a lot of wood. I'll pack a wool t-shirt. Once he gets, uh, once Satan gets that t-shirt done. Visitors. 
We'll see what they have. I don't really have too many things that I can part with right now. Mainly because we just went through like a month of toxic fallout. Not quite a month, but you know what I mean. Go ahead and do animal sleeping spots in here. That will more or less force them indoors so they can sleep and all that good stuff. This is now in a really weird spot. I don't know if I like it. No coaster. Don't stick to the cup. Mmm, chocolate milk. Alright, what? What was that? Oh, okay. We'll have to worry about, like, parkas and stuff like that soon, but... Go ahead and make this critical. I want them hauling all the things in here. Who's the good talker? Cameron Sweeney. You go talk to him. Or her, whatever it was. I don't I don't know, we're care. Gonna want the growing zones up and up again. Give them that food. I don't really want it. They could probably make a pila. Pila. Whatever that is. Of course. Well, let's get what they do have. Reset. That's fine. These people are coming. I'm gonna want Cameron Sweeney selected, so... We can get ready to come and trade with these people next. Who knows, maybe they'll have better things. Maybe, maybe not. There's a lot of bodies all over the place. Be a little questionable. They have a human. So why would you want to drive everything into a manhunting rage? I guess that's a last resort if you're getting a raid. Because everything will attack the raiders. But, a little dumb. They have a lot of high tech crap for no reason. Ugh. You bury that person, and Satan, you bury that person. I want them out of here. Thanks. So we're doing all that crafting and crap, so... Who's a plant cutter? Everybody? Put you back on four for the mining since uh your art's getting up there too. Winter has begun. Heater's a bit broken down. You get that in here. Yeah, it doesn't matter then. Be nice if I could smelt the metal. But Can we? Hold on. Yeah. I just never built it. That's why we don't we don't have the resources right now. Or anything. Where the mining is L. 
but I'm not gonna question it. I still have that build in mind, it's just, it's gonna take a lot of things. We're gonna need to trade for like a lot of metal or get a lot of wood or something like that. Alright, it's becoming a problem with their... Stop it. Their sleep schedule. They're going to sleep. From nine. To like five. Sure. Then they're going to do anything for an hour. Then they're going to work. Then we'll get some joy before bed. I got two hours of anything. We'll see how well that goes. Uh, because nothing's really getting done. Nothing's really being hauled. I want all these things to be grown. Earth rate's at 19%. Oh, it's a temperature thing. Yeah. Yeah, I can see it, I guess. We're gonna need that compacted steel. I don't know where Yeti went off to. Like, honestly. Said that he was going to be working on compacted steel. He's just up here. Ooh, somebody needs to get that wool. Hey, Yeti, go grab. Oh. I don't like how far you have to walk to do that. It's a lot of... A lot of metals that we have just sitting around. Gonna mine this out, so... Yeti doesn't have to go as far. But I mean, that's a lot of metal. It's 105 for every three that have 35. Oh no, he was just going a stupid way because he's dumb. Sorry, Yeti. Huh. But really, somebody grab that wool. Thanks. If you... If the animals are only supposed to go in the home zone, why are they outside the home zone? That's kind of irritating. Like, I don't care if they're following us. They... They're really supposed to just stay in the home zone. I hope they don't do that often. I'm gonna put your research on three. You're gonna be the only researcher. And right now, you just need a haul and clean. Aiden. How's your health, by the way? This video's been going on long enough, though. So that's going to do it for this episode of RimWorld. Remember to stay positive, have yourselves a great day. And hopefully, Satan will eventually be alright. I hope the fibrous mechanites go away. On their own. That'd be nice. And also, yay, no toxic fallout. But still, no one's plant cutting, which is stupid because they're all set to one. You know what? Except for Satan. Whatever, I'll figure it out. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.